In the earlier video, we learned how to differentiate between a robot and other machines. But what allows the robots to do things that they do? What are they made up of? So in this video, we are going to learn about the anatomy of robots. You must have learned anatomy of humans as part of your school syllabus, right? That humans have skeleton structure and muscles. We have got senses like ears, nose, tongue, etc. So robots do have their own anatomy. So we are going to learn that in this video. So pay good attention and listen to this. Now robots are made up of two things. Firstly hardware and software. I'm gonna repeat it. The anatomy of robots mainly divided into two parts. The hardware and the software. So now I'm sure you heard these words before. The hardware and the software. You must have come across it I think. So in this video, I'm going to explain you more in detail. What exactly do you mean by hardware? What's the meaning of the word or what it comes under the word soft software? So we are going to learn about the software and hardware. So first we'll go for hardware. Hardware is everything regarding robot that you can see and touch. This is the body of the robot. It includes the chassis, sensors, actuators, power supply, microcontrollers, etc. You don't worry about the words which I have just said are confusing to you. We are going to learn as we go along. So don't worry about that. But this is the broad things that come under the area of hardware. While software is the combination of the algorithm that runs on the robot along with the syntax used which gives the robot its intelligence. It also provides the robot with the capability to make decisions. So I would say that the software is the brain of the robot. As the same hardware running different software could behave as completely two different robots. Here while explaining to you about software, I also use terms like syntax and algorithm. Again, if you don't understand that, don't worry. That's what we are going to learn in the coming videos. Especially we are going to learn and write the algorithms on your own. Just don't worry about that. I just wanted to give you a brief idea of what comes under hardware and software. So now that we broadly know what a robot is made up of. Let us look at the different parts of robots more in detail. So in the next video we are going to look at hardware. 